Hey there, it's Leslie at Leslie's Cookies and Treats, and today let's make this little lacy ruffled border around our circle cookie. I'm using a 15 second royal icing consistency, and I'm just going to go around the edge kind of in a flower petal pattern. It doesn't need to be perfect, we just need to lay some icing down. And then I'm going to grab a flat paintbrush, and I'm going to get it wet and wipe off most of the water. And then I'm just going to drag in all of the icing in towards the center. If your border is thick enough, you can leave a little bit of it at the edge and just drag some of the icing in. My border is not thick enough, so I'm going to actually go over it again with icing. So for now, I'm just going to grab all of my icing and drag it in towards the center. But if, again, if you have a thick border, you can just grab a bit of it and leave a border all the way around. And if your paintbrush is sticking to the icing and it's no longer painting it onto the cookie, just go ahead and get it wet again and wipe most of the water off and continue on your way around. So like I said before, I'm going to go ahead and go all the way around again with icing. And because I don't want a really thick border to show here, I am now going to go back with my dampened paintbrush and just grab some of that icing and drag it in towards the middle, leaving a little bit of an edge all the way around. This will also make my lacy border um, a little more opaque and not quite as see-through, so it kind of depends on how sheer of a look you're going for, whether or not you want to go around and do this a second time. And just continue to play with it, dragging the icing until you get the look that you're trying to achieve. And then once you're finished, you have the choice of whether or not you want to set this cookie aside to dry for a little while while you do other cookies, or if you want to immediately pipe your center, um, I let mine dry for a little while because I had other cookies I was doing and I tried to pipe a circle um, with no guidelines and it didn't come out quite perfect so I'm taking my dampened paintbrush and I'm just going to move my circle outline a little bit and you saw it was sticking to the ice in there. I just got my paintbrush damp again, wiped off most of the water and I'll continue to try to perfect this circle before I flood it in. And that's it. These cookies are done. These would be really cute as daisies with a yellow center. Um, and they're just really pretty flowers for maybe a Mother's Day set or a birthday set. You could put a royal icing transfer or write some words in the middle. Or it's just cute the way it is. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please be sure to hit the like and subscribe button. I have new tutorials every single day. See you later.